all remember when the housing market crashed in 2008. Property values plummeted and people lost their homes by the hundreds of thousands across the country. Well, now some people here in Cuyahoga County say during that time they overpaid their property taxes, so they want that money back and they're willing to sue to get it. News 5's Amanda Van Allen is live in the Tech Center tonight. And Amanda, the county could stand to lose a whole lot of money here. Danita and Rob, this is a class action lawsuit. There's $5 million on the line. 4,000 people say the county overcharged them a decade ago. He's been fighting this for years. Yes, we'll fix it. No, we're not going to. No, we can't do it anymore because you know, we no longer have the money. Mark Musew is talking about Cuyahoga County, giving him the runaround about his property taxes since 2009. He says back when the housing market crashed and lots of folks were losing value on their properties, he got his office building reappraised. It said, we've agreed to lower your property value to this number. And if you agree with it or don't want to challenge it any further, then you don't need to do anything and it'll be reflected on your next tax bill. He says that never happened. The value on his office went from about $680,000 to just under 500,000 bucks, but he still paid taxes based on the previous appraisal and did so for years. At that point, I, I realized nothing was going to change. So we ended up filing a suit to get it fixed. We never should have had to file because they know they made a mistake. They admitted that they owed the money back and yet they still haven't paid it. That's Patrick Parati. He's the attorney leading this charge. And Parati says Musu wasn't alone. He's just one of thousands suing the county. But when you took money illegally, you have to give it back. Of course, we reached out to the con county for a response, but they say no comment. Live in the Tech Center, Amanda Van Allen, News 5.